The Coalition of Road Safety NGOs in Nigeria, Kosan, and the Civil Society on Mental Health and Drugs Demand Reduction in conjunction with the Federal Ministry of Transport have expressed worries over the spate of road crashes resulting to deaths and injuries in the country. They say this can be prevented with adequate care and support provided for victims when accidents occur. Plus TV, Emmanuel Ehijene has this report. According to statistics by the Federal Road Safety Corps, the World Bank and the World Health Organization, there has been an increase in road crashes in Nigeria for six consecutive years, leading to the death of 41,693 annually. These statistics was presented to the media by engineer Prosper Okafo in Abuja, or stating further that there is an astronomical rise in road crashes despite efforts by government's intervention, including the FRSC. This statistics was further corroborated by the Nigeria Auto Journalists Association in its February 2023 edition. As revealed by Mr. Ayobami Omiele, a retired assistant corps marshal of the Federal Road Safety Corps, at a recent retreat by the Commission in Lagos. Quoting from the Federal Road Safety official statistics, he said 5,053 lives we are lost in 2016, while 5,121 and 5,181 lives were cut short in 2017 and 2018, respectively. In 2019 and 2020, about 5,483 and 5,574 lives were also lost, respectively, while 6,205 lives got perished in 2021 alone. His submission was further elaborated by a mental health expert, Dr. James Komalafe, who stated that there is a nexus between road accidents and health of drivers generally. There is the urgent need for us to build this cut of road crashes, violation, and several stuff. So we have a compelling roadmap before us to say, hey, let's look at what we can do to abate it. Where we cannot do complete eradication, can we mitigate? And what are the tools, the incentives we have for mitigation? The CSOs have done the benefit of good and safe roads for the free flow of farm produce and other goods from one point to another. Farmers, when after farming, they still end up in the same place. You see, you see food item in a cluster. The, imagine someone farming something like tomatoes. After farming it, you don't even know. How, you remember, it's a perishable item. You don't even have a road to take it to where you're supposed to sell it. So this, the, the best of this of this organization is like uh, a dream come true for Farmers Home Foundation because we believe that one day. There will be a train track going around different places that farmers will just come and bring out their food items and sell it. At the end, the coalition called on the Federal Road Safety Corps, as well as Nigerians, to support and partner it to stop drugs and substance abuse as a way to reduce in crashes on the nation's roads and highways. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.